y'all welcome back to my youtube channel west indie collection if you are new to my channel welcome i'm glad to have you here so this video is gonna be so exciting because your girl is going on a mini vacation trip and um yeah i just got out the shower fresh I shaved my armpits and stuff um so basically my friend he um, told me that he wanted to do something special for me for my birthday. My birthday's not till like September, but um, he said I guess the time he'll be able to do it will be like this month. So we've been like playing this for about like a week, two weeks now. And yeah, like, so I'm so excited. He asked me would I prefer Myrtle Beach or Panama City Beach. And I guess we just decided to just go with like Panama. Um, and it's funny because he like was sending me stuff about like the, I think a hurricane or something, but, um, yeah, everything's good. I'm so excited. And that's one from my previous video when I went to the mall and stuff, got those outfits. So that was pretty much his treat to me as well to like, you know, Bill have something cute to wear. So I'm out of town and basically, um, yeah, he already booked our hotel room, everything like that. So I'm just so excited to have a good time. I got a nanny for my kids. This is a nanny that they, you know, was with in the past. So I'm so excited. Everything's great. So he's actually about to be here because he said his timing of getting here will be between like 8, 9, something in the morning. So I'm actually like kind of rush. I'm rushing on top of trying to get my place. Just, you know, straighten up before I leave because... I don't know about you, but I'm one of them types. I like to have my place like, you know, clean or organized, you know, before leaving out of town. So that way I'm coming back to a nice clean crib. And also this week, Monday through Friday, I guess they're going to be doing home inspections, making sure your floors is clean and mopped, your place just look clean and up to par, nothing damaged. So yeah, so I'm going to handle the rest all soon when I get back. But it's really just like clothes and stuff out, you know, because I'm still getting my place together as far as furniture, dressers and stuff. So yeah, anywho, um, I'm very excited. Um, Thomas is making breakfast for his brother. They're already ready. I think I just may have to add a few more mumble things to their duffel bag. And then I'm honestly just putting things, getting things organized to just put in my bag. So that way when he get here, we're ready. We go drop the kids off and hit the road because he did kind of plan on the time frame on when we'll be arriving and everything. So I'm just pretty much going to take y'all along with me on my mini birthday vacation that my friend would like to treat me for and i'm just excited i feel like i need this break i need a break from the kids because you know i'm i am like always with my kids so i also want to have alone time enjoy myself it's the last year in my 20s so yeah like i'm excited <laughs> I'm excited. So, yeah. So, I'm basically just getting ready. I'm going to put some lotion on. I'm going to put on a dress. Maybe some fit flops. Something chill for the car ride. Uh, I'm not going to really apply no makeup right now or anything. But, yeah. I'm just excited how this day is going to play out. So, technically, I could have. We could have went last night. But, he works as well. And, I honestly, I worked yesterday too. But, he works. And, you know, knowing that he lives further away. Like, he drives and stuff. So, I didn't want him to be tired. Picking me up. Dropping the kids off late last night at the nanny's house so he just figured he'll come here in the morning pick me up we're gonna spend a whole day there pretty much like half day tomorrow that way we're, we'll make it back in atlanta by like between like eight nine to go get my kids um what's another thing because you know it is like a couple hours just to get to florida and yeah that's pretty much it and um yeah because he lives like our and like 30 minutes away from me so yeah it's like a time thing with him as well so i'm excited he just texted me saying about 15 minutes away. Yeah, yeah. So I'm pretty much just, I'm just probably going to, I don't know, I may keep my hair like this for now, but I'm going to bring a scrunchie just if I want to put my hair up for the ride. But yeah, I'm really, really excited giving beach vibes and everything. So stay tuned on what this road trip is going to be about. So yeah, this is going to be obviously a travel vlog slash my mini B-Day trip. You know, it's early in August, but you know, Virgo season is coming up, period. And yeah, so... Stay tuned, y'all. Make sure y'all like this video. Hit the push notifications and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let's get it. <laughs> hey, guys. I literally just dropped the kids off with the nanny. They're all good, taken care of. She's paid. Everything great. Um, I'm almost started to kind of cry a little bit, but then he stopped because she held him. But he's been with her. He just probably, I think he was definitely walking, but he was obviously like kind of still younger. Now he's two. 
but yeah they seem pretty good and um I did end up giving her the car seat because she did say that she'll be the car seat so that's good so yeah now we're about to hit the road probably get something to eat um we're gonna head towards like Columbus and towards Panama City so stay tuned we're gonna get gas stuff like that so hey you guys don't mind my hair either I just took a shower kept it out so I put in putting so but yeah just chill a nice car ride Donuts, one vanilla, one strawberry, some French vanilla coffee, and a bacon, egg, and cheese on a bagel, y'all. So that sets the mood. Hey, y'all. So we made it to Columbus. He's getting gas right now, and then. I know we're gonna, I gotta use the bathroom. So I don't think this guy should have a bathroom, but I have to use the bathroom. And we're gonna go to the liquor store, get some drinks and stuff. And um, yeah, we're gonna then hit the road to go to Panama City. Panama City. <laughs> so yeah, we just got into the room. Now I'm about to just take my stuff out, get like situated and everything. But yeah, the room is lovely. It's a nice room. I love the aesthetic. I love the neutral colors. Like it's giving. I like the natural lighting and everything. So yeah, it's really like humid outside and everything. So I'm probably just gonna change my outfit and stuff. Probably also do something to this but yeah i just wanted to let y'all know that your girl has arrived safe and sound and yeah stay tuned <laughs> all right guys so me and him is about to take a shot oh orange shoes So cheers for my early birthday celebration. Yes. Ooh. I forgot to tap the little. <laughs> All right. 
Hey loves. Hey loves, so your girl is now done getting ready. I decided to keep my hair out and curly, natural. It's definitely giving beach vibes. I wish I had like some hair moves just to, you know, play around with it a little bit, but I still love it. I love it. I love the puffy look. Um, it's giving honey. But yeah, I just did like a little something. I tried to do something natural just to, you know, just put myself together a little bit. But um, I didn't want to overdo it though, like for now, because I know we're going out later and it's gonna be a whole new look. But yeah, you guys, um, so let me show y'all what I'm working with. This is outfit number one. So this is my outfit, guys. What you guys think on me? What you guys think? I'm gonna put some probably more, I'm probably gonna put some oil or like some lotion on again. Uh, your girl didn't bring no bra underwear, so I don't have no bra on, but it's okay because got the perfect titties, so it don't matter. I love how it's like a booty shorts. This is it's giving like I don't know, cheerleader. And I just decided to put on my Nike dunks that weren't fit flops or heels because it really, I mean, the all white I don't think would have like probably clashed because that's gold, and I have on like silver black like earrings, but I'm definitely gonna probably put some lotion on. Um, uh, I, f I couldn't find, <coughs> excuse me. I couldn't find like my sunscreen or whatever, but I'm just gonna put, probably put on some like body oil or just some more lotion just so I can look a little oiled up. What do you guys think? What do you guys think, you guys? Is it giving? What do you guys think? Comment below, leave a black heart or a red heart. What you guys think of the outfit? Okay. <laughs> to get a snack before our boat ride we're going to see the dolphins it did start it raining they may have an overpass so we're just going to see what happens we're about to just get a little snack at this restaurant and so yeah he's finding parking right now <laughs> we're here guys okay you guys so we are getting the island nachos we're going but he's not going to eat none because he's allergic to onions so we're going to also get the wisconsin white excuse me the wisconsin white cheddar bites i never had that before so i'm going to try it and then the fried dill pickle chips we're going to have because yeah so, yeah y'all yeah. this the cheddar bites she walked away i was trying to get her attention i have a question do you have the red salsa or just this salsa uh we have like actual chip salsa can i get that one too with this it'll come with the nachos I got you guys. Let me figure out who your server is. Okay, thank you. This is a different one. Alright, now um, we're getting blue cheese, but I'm going to try the pickles with the ranch. I don't know if it's a ranch. Let's try it. Mm. Not bad. Try it. Not too lucky. Not bad. Blue cheese. Okay. I'll try it with blue cheese. <laughs> I've been trying to make it for some time. We're about to board you guys at uh what time is it she said 
gonna get on it? 545. Oh, 545. It definitely smells like a sea. <laughs> Spectacular, maybe. Okay, so then uh, we have Kay in the galley if you want anything cold to drink or eat or anything like that. They Kay's in there to help you out. Okay, the boat's set up for 214 people. We have 80, 81 people going today. So there's plenty of room upstairs. The upstairs holds about 120 people. Hey you guys, your girl just got done getting showered, all clean up for the day. I just got done getting ready, so I just pretty much want to show you guys look number two. We are on our way to dinner tonight. We have reservations at 9.15, and the restaurant is called Firefly. Firefly. And so um, I guess they have like a whole bunch of like different seafood, stuff like that. So I'm excited. We were told that it's kind of like a dress-up type of restaurant, but your girl already had her outfit ready for any occasion. So yeah, let me show y'all look number two. And by the way, I enjoyed the dolphin boat ride. Um, we didn't get to see that many dolphins, but just the whole scenery, like I enjoyed like the seagulls, you know, like just looking at other things out in the water. Like, you know, we saw different boats and stuff. So it was just a nice, cool vibe, you guys. So yeah, just to touch base on that. So yeah, let me show you my outfit and then we gotta get going because we are now pressed on time. So look. Okay, so this is my fit, you guys. I got like a clear purse. I'm gonna put the purse down though so you guys can see all my stuff in my wallet. <laughs> but um, this is a pretty dress, I love it. It's definitely giving like fun. Um, It's definitely giving like fun going out. Let me fix my tag. Like fun going out. I love outfits that are so comfortable and everything. So yeah like i love it i kind of regret my hair just a little bit so it looked like my hair shrunk that's because of why and yeah you guys what you guys think about look number two what do you guys think i don't have no bracelets sorry and no other earrings i just wear the hoops again but um yeah this is like a little closer of how i look so yeah mm, all right you guys so, yeah the titties is tittying huh <laughs> but yeah y'all so hope you guys enjoy this look now we gotta go oh, come on oh, yeah. well, I tried, girl, you're yes, I but I guess you didn't know as I said a story told maybe now I got the flow cause I know it from the start maybe when you broke my heart that I had I love 
So this is savory. This is the bread. Bacon. Firefly was it was actually delicious like we had to definitely wait for some time even though we had reservations but the food was delicious and now we came to a strip club to check it out so let's see what they do here in Florida <laughs> Hi, you guys. So I'm back in my hotel room. You guys, it was a nice, cool vibe tonight at the strip club. Luckily, Craig knew somebody from back home. She was lovely. She was so nice to me, complimented me, chatted with us. We had drinks. There was another dancer that was cool. I got her Instagram. Um, they had a lot of dancers. It was like a nice, it's like a cool club. So like we chatted, we related on some things. It was nice. It was funny because like this dude came up to me when I stepped away. He was like, which way is the bar? I told him and then he goes, uh are you going up there and i'm like what he's are you going up there um i was like no he was like uh oh because i would have like waited so it's like i guess maybe some people thought i was a dancer but no like i could definitely relate to the that life because i used to dance and everything so i i get it but no but i just wanted it was nice just to like check out like you know look at the females and stuff like i just want to it was nice i just wanted to get out see something <laughs> but it was nice so yeah but that lime is throwing me off like i really do not like lime like i had like a corona i had a patron but that lime i'm not like lime i like lemon way better but yeah so when we came back craig tapped out <laughs> but we had a good time he showed love to the ladies like he tipped them and stuff so yeah but yeah like they they loved my look and everything. It was just like a nice vibe, you know? It was really nice. Um, the one girl was feeling me or whatever. <laughs> she said it was beautiful and stuff. It was just like, you know, female stuff. But yeah, but we're um back. I'm getting wind down. I'm about to take some cute, sexy pictures. I may post them on my OnlyFans. We'll see. I don't know yet. I don't, I'm don't. i still thinking because I'm not really... I'm not really on OnlyFans. But even though sometimes I may like share my link sometimes you know but it's not like i'm just committed to only fans if that makes sense but i got 
this i don't know if you guys saw my previous video this is a very very cute victoria's secret outfit i don't want to show you guys too much of all my goodies on here i don't know but no <laughs> may i may post these pictures on only fans i'm not sure i may just have it in my phone i don't know but i'll sh a little sneak peek i love it. it looks so beautiful on me so yeah i'm just about to take some cute pictures and then just pretty much wind down eventually go to sleep and i may actually end this vlog here because um we do leave tomorrow we're probably gonna obviously have breakfast they have breakfast actually at the hotel and stuff there's some other things i probably want to do or things we're gonna like do before we actually head back home tomorrow but i'm not gonna probably vlog every single thing so i may just close the vlog out here so i just want to say if you guys made it this far thank you guys for watching make sure to like this video subscribe hit the push notifications i really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and yeah like i had a good time today like I just want to show you, like, show you guys a tip, like, travel, you know, because a lot of people don't want to travel or they think they have to do this or do that to travel, but you can really, I was just telling Craig this today, like, you can really do a lot in one day if you plan your day out and actually have a plan. Sometimes when you go on vacation, when you with your family, your homegirls, y'all, like, kind of go with the flow, and that's why you guys probably may come across as, like, unorganized. But when you actually have like something like things actually lined up and plan on a schedule or reservations, it makes the traveling just experience so much better. Um, of course, you want to give yourself some like time in between, depending if you, you know, have the time. But definitely, I encourage you guys to definitely, you know, travel and just know that you can do really a lot in a day. I have been tired at times today, but I pushed through. Um, and yeah, it was just a nice vibe. So yeah, I'm just in the room, about to chill, relax. And I'm actually going to fall asleep in this lingerie. So yeah, you know, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling sexy and stuff. So yeah, I'm actually going to fall asleep in this tonight and um, wind down, you guys. So thank you guys for watching.